I'm Scott Monty, and welcome to another Fit to be Tied. Look, the whole Facebook political advertising thing has really become a hot-button issue, and yesterday, of course, Jack Dorsey made it clear at Twitter that they're not going to participate in paid political advertising, which is the right decision. But I was concerned because I saw something come from Campbell Brown, who's the global head of news for Facebook, he wrote, I strongly believe it should be the role of the press to dissect the truth or lies found in political ads, not engineers at a tech company. And you know what? Okay, fine. I understand that engineers might not be the best arbiters of political truth. The solution is simple. Don't accept political ads. And in case you are wondering that this is about free speech, it's not. Everyone is still able to say what they want on this platform. Stop allowing people to put money behind it and pay for it. But look, there's more to this than that. Facebook wants journalists to do its job for it. You've heard the aphorism, a lie is halfway around the world before the truth has a chance to get its pants on. Well, what journalist is going to be able to move with the speed and scale that Facebook does at its algorithmic level? Jack Dorsey said, Internet political ads present entirely new challenges to civic discourse. Machine learning based optimization of messaging and micro targeting, unchecked misleading information, and deep fakes all at increasing velocity, sophistication, and overwhelming scale. Now, this is just it. It's targeted deception. It's not broadcast. It's not like we're all seeing the same thing. So asking journalists who are already experiencing cuts across the board to do this kind of micro-research on your platform is irresponsible. When you consider that campaigns have hundreds of millions of dollars and they're putting it toward these scale no newsroom can combat. Essentially, you're telling everyone that, hey, here's this forest fire that we've started. You all have squirt guns. Get to work. Well, what we're telling you, Facebook, is just throw away the matches and lighters. So